There is a new approach to assisting those who are unsheltered in Salt Lake City. Fox 13 News reporter Maithili Gubi explains how city leaders hope a temporary shelter will help. It's something that the city says has never been done in Utah before. I'm here at the corner of 3rd South and 6th West in downtown Salt Lake City. And by November, the city hopes to transform this empty space into a temporary shelter community for about 50 people who need a place to live. Now, unlike other congregate shelters, and this sanction camp would be a place for people to have a whole unit for themselves and would be their place as long as they live there. There will be security and access to other resource services to help more people move to a more permanent home. These units, um, they're, it's you know four walls, a door that you can lock. Your personal belongings will be safe. Your, your person will be safe. Uh, it will be heated and cooled. It'll be a heating and cooling unit for every, uh, for every um, uh, one of these non-congregate units. There'll be lighting, outlets, electricity, The city and state are working on finding a provider who can build and manage this space. They hope to finalize someone next month. Now Salt Lake City Aaron, Mayor Aaron Mendenhall did tell us and acknowledge that this is not enough to help every person experiencing homelessness in our community, but hopes that it's a step toward finding a sustainable solution. Now this is only phase one of the project. The city hopes to use what they learned to build a more permanent housing solution in phase two by the middle of next year. Live in downtown Salt Lake City, I am Mike B, Fox 13 News, Utah.